Okay, good afternoon and welcome to Ion Mitzion. We're doing uh, Maestros. Mishnah's Maestros. We're in Perak Aleph. I want to talk about really Mishnah's Gimel and Dalit, and really include Mishnah Be- Bez over here. What's there in vegetables? Dalit talks about vegetables. In Bez and Gimel, we're talking about fruits ostensibly. Peros, right? Mishnah Bez, Mishnah Bez, Peros, Chayavos, and Gimel is really an extent, is a continuation of, of Mishnah Bez. So <clears throat> there's vegetables and there's fruit. The difference is a very important difference when it comes to Shumas and Maestros. Vegetables, right, Yorok is chayev, right, immediately they grow even a little bit, they're chayev and Shumas and Maestros because apparently they're edible right away. Fruits take more time, only when the, and the Mishnah goes, talks about all different types of fruits. When it has, and there are certain signs that tell you when it's ripe enough to be called chayev and Shumas and Maestros, or called edible enough. Now, <clears throat> I'm not uh, a farmer. I don't, I don't have a garden where I plant vegetables and fruits. I can't really tell you, but I am a person who eats food and eats vegetables and fruits sometimes. I actually bought some apples, golden apples this week. Um, my wife was shocked when I was eating apples. She's like, whoa, whoa, I never thought I'd see you eating a snack, a healthy snack. Usually I eat ice cream, chocolate, things like that. She was shocked that I was eating golden apples. But you know what? Once in a while, we're trying to save a little money. Apples are a lot cheaper than, you know, an ice cream bar. So... I was eating apples, and I'll tell you, fruits by themselves are not too, are not good. And vegetables, everyone knows, no one eats vegetables. I mean, only the, these women who are trying to lose weight, they go and they go to the to the bar. You know, they have these smorgasbords at the wedding. They're always at the salad bar, taking those carriage sticks and dipping them in the Thousand Island dress. <laughs> yes, they could be tasty fruits and vegetables by themselves, but. The only fruits which really are tasty, I think, are bananas and apples. I think those are the only ones that are tasty. And really, I believe fruits and vegetables were not meant to be. Gan Eden, maybe you're supposed to eat them, but we don't live in Gan Eden anymore. We were kicked out of Gan Eden. You know, maybe if you live in Gan Eden, you could, you could eat fruits and vegetables. But we eat meat, we, and, and fruits and vegetables have a purpose, and they're used to sweeten things to give taste to other foods. Cook with, you cook uh, meat with vegetables. Um, you know, so main parts of your, of your meal the appetizers and the main part of the meal, those are usually accompanied either with vegetables, cooked vegetables, grilled vegetables, or they're sweetened by vegetables. You mix vegetables in a stew or something like that with the meat. Onions are very good for that. These are types of vegetables. That's the point. That's the difference between a vegetable and a fruit. Vegetables are meant to spice up your meal. Uh, fruits are meant to spice up your drinks and your desserts. And that's the difference between fruits are much sweeter usually than... But not, fruits are, not, are, are than vegetables. Fruits are not meant to be eaten by themselves. They're meant to... Either accompany maybe ice cream, you have some strawberries with ice cream, or have strawberry ice cream, you know, to flavor uh, the good stuff, flavor your drinks. You know, they have these spring drinks here in Israel, which are pretty good. They don't have in America. I always wonder why they don't have in America, but I guess it's just like different cultures, you know, more materialistic in America. They have Snapple in America. Here they have these spring drinks. I like them. They're pretty good, some of the flavors. Um, but I consistently notice the only ones that are really good usually are the ones that have either apple or banana, or both apple and banana in them. Um, the apple and banana I usually give it a good taste. Those are the only two good fruits, and then uh, two two good fruits. And they're used to spice of drinks, which the Ram says is supposed to have drinks at the end of the meal. You could have drinks during the middle of the meal if you want. And <clears throat> you know, fruits are also mixed into wines to you know give flavor to wines. So <clears throat> um, when the mission says distinction over here that vegetables are already high of right when they start to grow. I don't think it means that all vegetables are ripe immediately. You can ask a gardener, you can ask a farmer, I'm not really sure. I don't think, you know, the second it starts sprouting the vegetable, it's ready to eat. I don't think so. But I do believe that the taste that the vegetable will impart in meat or in a different food uh, will be constantly pretty much the same right when it emerges and when it grows older. And therefore, it doesn't make a difference because the whole point of the vegetable is to spice other foods or to give taste to other foods, and it will give the same taste even when it's small. However, when it comes to the taste of fruits, which is usually a sweeter taste because you want your drinks to be a little sweeter, your desserts to be a little sweeter, those <clears throat> will only be sweet enough. In the beginning, they're bitter. They only come sweeter when they're more ripe. And when they're more ripe, they have their, the taste differs in a fruit, an unripe fruit and a ripe fruit. And that's the sort of saying, fruits are high and so when they're ripe enough to impart a sweet taste on whatever drink you're mixing them, mixing them with or whatever dessert you're mixing them with. I think what I have is a very unique take between the difference in fruits and vegetables. And esrog is included in vegetables over here because I don't think esrog, you know, make esrog jelly. Um, I don't think it's a dessert. I don't think esrog jelly tastes too good. And maybe you mix it, you can mix esrog with your meat. I don't know. You can try it. But I think it's more of a vegetable 
Uh, anyway, that's what I have to say about this. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one.